while there is no updates in AC Rebellion, and well, I, I play in AC Rebellion, but it's already become for me a routine play. Just collect DNAs, do some, some achievements. So I start to play Clash of Clans. Why did I start to play uh, Clash of Clans? Uh, because I was searching for the game uh, which uh, also offers some strategic planning because I like I like the strategic planning of the games um, and also this uh, game offer a lot of like multiplayer options this game Clash of Clans is not a new game it's like already many years however this is good it's not new game so it's matured matured so it's uh, the proper amount of events, proper amount, and it's just planning and it's just fun and I see how the game is progressing and uh, there is just simply fun to, fun to do. And there is already uh, many multiplayer options. You can um, like uh, you can attack. There is single player. There is attack multiplayer, and uh, there is a main base. Uh, where you can uh, also join the clans. I join some, some. Firstly, I join some random clan, but these guys uh, uh, get pretty nice, and uh, yeah, I, I, I like the clan I joined. So also there are some events. For example, now events uh, come in some uh, clan war. Uh, so I'm join some clan war. There is clan war here. So there is like second day of the war. Um, well, we're doing good, our clan doing good in the war, but also what today I want to speak not about the main layout, maybe I will return back to this if you want to watch to that Clash of Clan video, but actually I, uh, I want to talk about this because as the game progressed and the game was starting from the uh, main uh, from like the main village basically you build a strategic plan uh, uh, you make some uh, you build your army attack others also others attacking you but also as the game progressed they uh, offered uh, uh, in addition to the main uh, main village they offer some kind of like and so a builder island or builder village so it's a little village which is uh, more slow to progress but also because it's smaller uh, so it's more like kind of like can say manageable and uh, what i want to share with you i want to share with you my this build uh, today uh, this uh, builder village layout um, i was uh, at uh, this is layout for the builder hall level four so every time you um, upgrade uh, now I'm upgrading to the level 5, so every time you upgrade you will get more and more uh, some different buildings to, to build. So, but I figure out that this layout is pretty tricky and good and it's well strategically planned. So w what happened, I have seen this layout once. Uh, during the play uh, with some another uh, opponent but later I modified and uh, I think it's working for me ac uh, against the targets with the same builder hall level 4 it's working like 80% of the time so how the multiplayer here is works is also very interesting once you click attack and find now so it's attack you attack so it's find an opponent, you attack his village, and at the same time he is attacking your village. So and what's happened with this uh, build a whole level four? I go to pretty high this pretty high uh, like uh, rank that now uh, my build a whole five. I only meet the players with the higher rank, with the higher, with the more building, with the more stronger army. So my army is not so strong, I don't have many like like heroes or something, but I still like kind of winning and going up, you know, it's so strange. So uh, because I'm going to upgrade this uh, builder hall, uh, now I want to share with you layout and see how, uh, show you how it works uh, in the wars. And if you play this game or you want to play this game, maybe it can be useful. And uh, uh, all my opponents on my rank is much more higher so let's see how it works for example today i played uh, several games and uh, you see i have a streak of victories yeah th there is not sometimes defeat sometimes people think and they can win my layout but well more than 50 percent of time without thinking they just losing 
So let's start from the whatever. Okay, let's start from the top. So somebody from Romania, later army from Russia, Russian guy. Okay, so let's see uh, how uh, the 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 uh, for example my base how my base is uh, working. So here the guy will attack me. So he basically attack me with the generic warriors and he don't think too much and attack from the one side. Uh, they don't uh, usually attack from this side because here is the crasher that will crash all the warriors in, in, in one time. So basically if they plan the same uh, massive attack from this side, all will die here. Because this layout of the walls, it's tricking them into, into here. And also, the walls are built in this way that they should always walk around, walk around, walk around. So they are not damaging the walls or breaking through the walls, but they always walk around. And this is why they are all dying and failing, because need to walk around. So this, you see, uh, he has this uh, hero and uh, uh, pretty big army, but uh, he still failed. Let's see how I took his base. So, of course, when I take in their base, their base are more, uh, like, stronger in many cases. Yeah, for example, his base is more stronger, so he has mortar, he has a, 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 uh, the hero, and uh, anyway, basically, he has more uh, other buildings. He has two storages, uh, two mines, two storages, two it's much more uh, buildings generated because his level his level is uh, one level up so he's build a whole five and basically my approach is uh, just simply and he's all you see he's all protected so i found the weak point his weak point he put his uh, builder hole too close to the wall so i basically um, one by one you will see i will attack from a different size and one by one to the builder hole one by one to this builder hole and finally i will kill this builder hole and one by one clean 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 a little bit so i i, I take some time I, I speed up to show you i take some time for strategic planning and uh, just to simply clean out uh, their like uh, some buildings let's say so just mostly i win by the score not by the stars but here it's good so i try to to two stars like to get exactly like more than 50 because here how the scoring how the scoring works one star for the main building and one star for the 50 percent damage and another star for 100 percent damage so it's it's pretty uh, pretty good so you see i i just win him by the score and by the stars so let's say, for example, another guy. So another guy attacked me with the same amount of archers. I have uh, like 24. He also have uh, he has 24 archers. So I think he didn't uh, think too much. I will speed up. No, he, he was thinking, but uh, basically he, he just all around and he could he could do it better. He could do it better if he uh, plan more. So maybe he can uh, do a little bit better. Maybe maybe could do 50%. So, but uh, what what is interesting about this layout is it's trick people to believe it's easy. So let's see how I deal with him. Ah, uh, uh, he he ah uh, no, he's high level. You see, he has mortar. I also speed up because. Otherwise, my 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 approach taking time. So I uh, I just uh, oh he has a flamethrower. So his defenses is just seriously higher than mine. You see mortar plus flamethrower plus something and 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 still I win him by the score. I couldn't take his main building, but probably I take. I even didn't take. 50 percent yeah just clean 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 whatever i can clean like calculating and counting every move and every archer 46 so maybe i could do him for 50 percent but it's difficult so anyway he just thought my layout is easy and easy to take him but it's not okay let's take the third one 
and uh, we'll finish with this. For example, this one, uh, some Russian guy, and pretty high level. So he uh, move some more, but he didn't really think. He didn't really think a lot. So he deploy all the troops from one side, which is well, not. You will just you just simply will watch him dying. So he even didn't. Okay, maybe they will reach a crusher. So let's see how now all of these small guys will die. Yeah, and that's it. And only one hero left. So two defenses and crusher. He will finish the crusher, but my defenses will finish him. So, well, he maybe could destroy me, but with with this with var uh, with var barbarian, it's not really easy to do that. So let's see. Oh, okay, where did I go? Let's see how I go. Uh, how did I do his base? Okay, his base. I also I I found there is a weak point in his base because there is uh, you see there is some holes there. So and I firstly move one by one, move one by one because there are some uh, maybe uh, you see some defenses, bombs and something. Once I clean all the bombs, later I deploy all the troops. So uh, in in the hope that they will destroy the main building. But also I have uh, archers here, just five archers, and I see that here is defenses are pretty weak. So I, I, I just uh, try to clean his defenses here. So finally I uh, destroy main building here and later archers one by one and uh, with uh, very weak defenses from that side. Um, so I, I clean another like for 50%. So you see archers is slowly, slowly, it will take time. I will speed up a little bit. So like clean this, clean this, later clean that. So yeah, 55%. So anyway, I just simply want to share with you my, uh, like what I am doing when I have nothing to do uh, with AC Rebellion. I play in a little bit uh, the Clash of Clans and uh, well, it's fine, it's, uh, it's give you, um, once you attack, uh, you can attack uh, roughly like three times per day. So uh, later you will for 24 hours or maybe once per 20, 21 hours. Anyway, roughly three times, uh, three times a day, to get some score to get. So it's not uh, very much like work to do. So it's it's kind of fun. Also, I am enjoying uh, the um, like main game. Uh, so I am enjoying uh, this uh, clan wars and uh, our clan uh, doing good in this war. So that that's that's fun. So anyway. Hope you also have a nice game. That was Clash of Clans on Android.